to the shop. Uh, today we're getting started on the cab of the C10. I'd like to start off by welcoming all the new subscribers to the channel. Thank you very much. I appreciate you uh, giving me some of your time. It means a lot. And welcome back to the continued supporters of the channel. So anyway, what we're going to do today is we're going to drill the spot welds out of the uh, inner cab panel. It's welded to the inner lip of the rear window, front window, or windshield, and inside the door panel here. And you can see there's like the little indentions in the metal. That's the spot weld. So in order to do this, uh, what, what I've done is I've taken a punch and a hammer and I've got as close to the center of each spot weld as possible and I made a little indention and then I'm going to go back with what is called a spot weld cutter and this is it. It's basically just a really small hole saw and it's got a, a spring loaded pin in the center of it. So what you do is you put it up against or put the tip of the pin in the little indention you made with the punch apply pressure, not too much pressure because you can break the pin on the hole saw and then you just uh, start drilling and it will cut a little circle around the spot wheel. And when you've got to remember when you're doing this, if you are going to weld from the inside out, always drill from the inside out. That way you don't drill all the way through and then you have a hole back here and then you have to use either a brass plate or a copper plate to put behind it so you can fill that hole. If you don't drill all the way through, it's, it's a lot easier. So anyway, I've already drilled one and two right here. And after you drill them, then you take your panel knife, which all it is, a piece of flat steel. I forgot, I think I got this from Auto Body Tool Mart or somewhere. And you go right here to your seam, right between your two pieces of metal, take a hammer, and it separates. And that's all you got to do. And you got to do this all the way up. Right there it's done. And then I'll come back to this side, catch it between the two panels. to it.
mouse nest that I pulled out of the right rear cab corner. It's amazing where they get, and I mean they do get everywhere, tractor torque tubes, trunks of cars, but this is the first one I've ever gotten out of a cab corner, especially up there in the, uh, in the roof panel. So anyway, uh, that's it. Uh, part two, we will go over how I prep the surface to weld the new panel in and also how I prep the new panel to be welded in. So. Uh, Welcome to the new subscribers. Thank you for uh, your subscription. Welcome back to the continued supporters of the channel. And if this is your first time watching and you haven't subscribed yet, please do hit the little button in the corner. That'll help me out. I greatly appreciate your time and your attention. 
and we'll see you next time for part two of the installation of the C10 roof panel. Yeah, there it is. Have a great night from Old Red Tractors, and we'll see you soon.